check it out. A, V, A, 1, 2, mail car, passenger, that, that, and that. And yesterday I was running 10, 10 cars, 3 engines, and I kept, it just derailed once, but it's such a major pain in the butt. And now that I've lengthened it, see this is all, I'm just trying to learn. And I love getting these to where they run. And it's just smooth and beautiful for that. Yeah, you know, that light just really is a beautiful set. This is the uh, Super Chief one, Santa Fe. And then right here is a Zephyr with the correct engine, but I need to. I've already got the B, so this is A, I'll have the B coming tomorrow, and I'll buy six Zephyr cars, and I'm done, and this, no, and I'm also collecting another one, but right here we go, As you can see, I have uh, made it bigger. I took away the tunnels at the far end, so every time they derail at the far end, I'd have to move the tunnels. So I've got them going through two little tunnels. No, one, two, three, four tunnels. And That's that. And it's all built around. Look at that. As soon as it's done, it's already coming back. And that's quite a steep uh, grade I got over there. It's it's sudden. Uh, it's a little steeper than I planned, but this is a work in progress. So, this tunnel, this is the mountain right now, I mean, see this cuts off, this is going to be the, uh, like a, a yard, like a mini yard, but it's too hard to make a, a yard in the middle of a, a turn like this, there's not enough room to make a proper yard. The only way I could do it, possibly, is you need a main line to go through it, and then it cuts off. So, if I use this as the main line, this cuts off, and I would have to have super sharp turns to, like, what, three, two or three things, uh, you know, lines to build your... And I could do one for the Zephyr, one for... Or one for Santa Fe, one for Union Pacific, and one for uh, Western Pacific. But just look at all of all these engines only run up here. They run great on this track. This is this is like a you know a NASCAR track. This is the NASCAR track of trains. Nothing but Kato. And it runs nice and smooth. As you can see, I've taken away most of the, uh, well, all of the. And uh, I'm using uh, basically flattened cardboard boxes for a lot of the. Uh, put on top of it for uh, height and to 
you know, make it go up, make it go down, become even. Just like right here, it took forever to figure this little, to get it to, uh, right here. This is a pain in the butt, this, so this is the main cardboard wrapped, so it won't, you know, there it is, and then that sat on this, and then I made another a circle around it all on this, but when I expanded it, I got more board, expanded it, but I didn't have enough room to go out another three inches, so I shoved it under it, and then that made this a quarter inch or a half inch almost, so I'm actually putting track on track in order to level it and now it runs beautiful and it was impressive to see you know 10 cars and three engines but it's not impressive to put back on the dang track in fact it drives me insane so my next thing is to get the uh, DCC going so I can run this train and then I can run that train because these are all, you know, new Kato DCC compatible or they, some of that is the go for DCC that one is too both are those are also and I want to run those on that track too. But right now, this uh, not a, not called a turnout. I'm trying to think of the proper name. It's uh, oh, just talking about this up in Utah. I'm at the promontory with my son again, and the cut off from the main line that was going to come down to Salt Lake. What do they call that? A not a split. It's a a turn. It no. It's a no. I'm not gonna think of it while I'm here. But you know what I'm talking about. They take off the main line and they go down so people can you know load up their stuff. It's a. Uh, let me think. Let's see here. You see, I want to get some more buildings. So now that I've got that in here, oh, this is my you know, basically my uh, golden spike trains sitting under that but I want to get all of these running so I want to get all of those running all of those Arnolds back up here and I got a Bachman up there running it's noisy as crap but it runs good and then uh, you yeah. know keep working with this I think I got six on here is all I got I think that's the magic number, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, yeah, six, I think, let's count it, with three cars, it's, it's cool, here we come, a one, a two, a three, a one, a two, a three, a four, a five, and a six, with the light. Beautiful, beautiful. So I was also thinking making a mini yard here because I've got the room and I've already kind of done it. So I can make a little yard here with, and it could come out and in and out and stop or whatever on each side. And then 
at the yard over here. This can come here, and then one can shoot off that way. And I just push that mountain back, because all it is is it's a tunnel. And the track does come out the other end. Let's see, now I can move these over here, because that one's got a lot of detail. That was nice. That was too close. I think I need to push it back. But that was a nice one. And this is a big old honking one, but it's nice. And uh, I had to hack at the, uh, at the uh, hole there to get these big guys able to run in there. Like that, I think. Alright. Well, that's it. Say goodbye to the Super Chief Warbonnet ABA one two three four five six seven gosh I mean what I got like for the what they they call that train uh spur jeez so what I was thinking was this would be the spur to come out and then from that spur that would go out and around. Now if it connects, then that would just be a, a main line that would... And then I could take off of that and make it this very small yard here. And a very small yard here. What do you think? No one really uh, gives me advice anymore. I could use a lot. I mean, look at this. I know I'm in the beginning stages, and, you know, five years this will be set up in a, in a room of its own. It'll be gigantic, just like all the other ones are, and I'll have mountains. My plan is to have a, a mining part with mountains and mines. That's why I do this stuff up here. That's my mountain mining stuff, the little lake and everything. That's a mine, not a lumber thing. And then I got the really nice train going around it. And please give me advice. Thanks. I'm on my own. And I'm doing it my way. Which could be the wrong way. There we go. One more time.